Are you? Good. Hi. Thanks for coming. Right, so one of the first things we can do is learn how to hold our racket. If you pretend you were going to shake somebody's hand and then you hold your racket like that, that's going to be a really good start for us to do our forehand. Just pointing your racket where you want the ball to go. That's <laughs> as simple as you can get, in it? Off we go. So now we know how to hold our racket. Doesn't matter how gentle we're doing it. I'm still learning the right things. Nice. So we can try and keep our racket away from our body a little bit. Nice. Good. Try and keep your racket facing back a bit longer. Good. So just a quick one, we're just going to look at these balls. They've just got different compression. The ball that bounces a bit slower and lets us have more time to hit the ball properly rather than making us rush. So we're going to do some volleys. All it means is that the ball's not going to bounce. All right, so we're going to hit it before it bounces. Perfect, and again. And we're not going to swing at all. We're going to just push forward. Oh, even turn your racket around. That, that's showing off. So you're getting pretty good at your forehand. So what you're going to try and do is try and put your racket back to the middle every time. Nice. It really is working, though, isn't it? Lots of little tips that we're learning, but at the end of the day, we're just playing tennis. Hit the ball and then put it back. That's it. Yes, that was very good. We said it was easy to get started, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, same now. Competitive already, look. <laughs> no.